Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Don of AhmedDon.com. Today I'll have another episode of Chromebook Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about how to change primary owner on your Chromebook. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel, I'm always trying new and different ideas. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel to subscribe. If you're looking for more Chromebook videos, there will be links in the description box below. So if you'd like to change the owner on your Chromebook, uh, the thing is Chromebook doesn't allow to change primary owner so you have to actually go through a factory reset and that's what I'm going to show you today so the first thing I'm going to be showing is that how to see or find out whether you are the primary owner on your Chromebook or not so there are two ways you can do that the first way is going to be when you turn on your Chromebook so if you just turn this on so once the Chromebook is on it's going to show the name and if you click on it then here you can see that this is the name of the owner and this is the primary owner so that's one way to find out now there are other ways to find out if you are the primary owner and uh, these are the steps so you have to go to settings which is going to be on the clock on the lower right corner and then security and privacy and manage other people so we're just going to follow the step so my Chromebook is on and I'm going to go to settings which is the whole button right here and then I'm going to security and privacy which is going to be on the lower side so if you just you know click on it here is the security and privacy and once you click on it then you're going to see that manage other people so if you click on it and here you can see that there are some sliders and it's letting you drag these sliders so that means that you're the primary owner if you're not the primary owner these options are not going to let you drag it so if you see these options and you're able to change them that means you are the primary owner so now if you'd like to ch change the primary owner of the Chromebook account uh, the way you can do it you have to do a factory reset I do have a separate video about factory resetting your Chromebook which I'm going to be put a link in the description box below but today I'll just show you very shortly or, or briefly how you can do factory reset so you have to go to settings again advanced reset settings and reset so click on the lower right corner where the clock is and then here you're going to click on the wheel button which is the settings and then we're looking for advanced which is going to be to the lower left corner which is right here advanced so if you click on advanced and from here you're going to click on reset settings and which is kind of the last option right here so if you click on that and then here is going to you'll see reset so which is right here reset it's also called power wash so once you click that button it's going to reset your whole uh, Chromebook and then what it means that it's going to erase everything on your Chromebook and it's just going to give you kind of like you know a brand new Chromebook and then the first person log into the Chromebook is going to be the primary owner of the Chromebook just a word of caution that uh, if you have any anything stored on your Chromebook just remove them or uh, you know back them up because um, once you do a factory reset it's going to erase or delete everything and you're gonna have nothing on your Chromebook so after that you just log in uh, or whoever wants to be the primary owner can log in into the Chromebook and that person is going to be the primary owner so just to sum up everything Chromebook does not allow to change primary owner uh, without having or doing a factory reset and you can change or you can uh, assign a new primary owner once you go through the factory reset or power wash and also before you do that you can check how to uh, you know who's the primary owner uh, either on the main login screen or you can just follow these steps to check if you are the primary owner so that's all for today thank you for watching this video there will be more videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you.